the boys locker room incident is clearly a very uh, shocking incident uh, when it comes to cyber crimes against children and uh, this is a criminal offense the kind of uh, abusive comments written on the group and uh, uh, the chat it's uh, involving you know incitement to commission of an offense uh, it is uh, also uh, you know instances of uh, use of offensive language and uh, it could also involve uh, you know uh, outraging modesty of women children the pocso law as well so if you come to the sections of uh, the it act uh, which is the main act involved uh, there are clear sections which say uh, you know prohibit the circulation and publication of any kind of obscene content especially ex sexually explicit content online and there are punishments up to 3 years uh, of uh, no imprisonment and uh, fine in, in section 67 67a which uh, again prohibits actually explicit content including videos and images uh, has a punishment of uh, about 5 years of imprisonment and fine and uh, apart from this the ipc criminal intimidation is uh, you know uh, gives a punishment of about 2 years of imprisonment and fine defamation under section 500 if it involves a defamation of any particular girl uh, it, it will be again punishable offence up to 2 years of imprisonment and fine so the kind of abusive language used on the platform and the kind of uh, you know uh, content there is certainly invites uh, you know criminal investigation and uh, all these uh, provisions of law will be attracted clearly in the pocso law sexual harassment is uh, clearly attracted in case there any girl is sexually abused uh, you know and if it's a child below 18 years of age uh, section 11 and 12 uh, also you know prohibit sexual harassment of any girl again up to 3 years of imprisonment and fine so these sections are open together uh, clearly you know uh, lay down how shockingly uh, you know difficult circumstances can be because many of these offenses which may be attracted in a case it will be very difficult to see uh, whether there is any innocence involved uh, in the person because uh, ignorance of law is no excuse but in criminal law uh, the malified intent and the knowledge is both very important because uh, that is a crucial role to play in any kind of investigation you know to to penalize anybody so uh, the investigation is on and uh, it's important for parents and teachers and you know people at large children to know how uh, you know netiquette is so important today because a lot of these actions uh, are happening online and uh, people are not aware of the consequences that they can be so grave it's high time in the day that these uh, you know episodes like these are not repeated in the online space thank you